Hi, this is Subhu, Rigging Artist and Programmer. In this video, I will explain about cluster-based controls and multiple constraints. Cluster-based controls are nothing but deformation controls. Generally, we will use these deformation controls in human face like left and right area, cheeks area and breathing like effects. For example, bird, we can take it here. Some other areas we can see pillow depressions like we can use this script. In this video, I will explain two options. Mirroring option. Mirroring option means sometimes we need this type of controls on both sides uh, of human face. Here I will take sphere as a human face example. Here I want to make uh, two depressions for eyes and one nose. Uh, one can download this script from creativecrash.com. We can access documentation from here. How to install this script in your local system. In Creative Crash one can download this script from here in this area. Here I have provided one video presentation for how to create bypass rigging with automation. These tools are provided in bonus tools in this script. For scaling purpose, I have provided global control here. We need to enter global control here. Top group here. We need to select two edges. For mirroring options was selected here. First, we need to create control locations where we need to controls. Let us create two control locations at these two areas. Now we have to select set members like uh, vertex. I selected roughly these areas. These are the controls created. We need to smooth this, this control. We can check this deformation something like this. Or we can project it out. make eyes now. Now we are going to create single location. After creating nose and mouth controls, we can use them something like this. Now we had a rough human face cut. By using these deformation controls for here, we can get this deformation type of effects with this script. And even these controls are scalable.
this controls travel along with the mesh yeah this is about cluster based controls now I am going to show how to use this multiple constraints this is the multiple constraint script with this we can apply many type of constraints at a time from one to many the base control whatever it is from that we are going to apply this one I have entered here in this case I am going to apply M constraint for all these sphere heads we can take a look at direction of the control Z direction is facing towards front side so we need to select it after selecting all these spheres we will apply the constraints now all heads turn towards this this one something like this this is the script we have used for robo previous time uh, various formations we have used this script it helped a lot for multiple constraining in global formation sphere formation tunnel formation drill formation like many other formations we have done in previous time one example we can see here here guns opening and closing all depends upon the direction of that axis so some other time this script sorry some other time this type of script is useful for scaling purpose here we can see all the feathers are not scaling according to the global scaling it is difficult to apply scaling for each and every individual feather here sometimes on groups we cannot apply in this case if we apply for group it won't apply here so we can select all the main control groups here now we are going for scale constraint Thank you for watching.